Today, I'm contractually obligated via binding vow to talk about the Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2 trailer, Part 1, the esteemed pre-sequel to JJK Zero. So obviously this trailer has beautiful animation, but to me it's less the animation, it's more the color correction they did. It actually looks a lot like the color correction used in interlobed footage, and it's looking a lot more vibrant than I expected it to be. But maybe MAPPA employees were just getting depression from making Attack on Titan Season 4 Part 3. But I don't know if Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2 is going to solve that problem. Personally, I'm more interested in seeing Shibuya animated. I mean, hidden inventory is pretty good, but I've never been the biggest fan of flashbacks. But this brings us to the most important discussion about this trailer, that we have Monkey Titan slash Dio Brando in it. And now this translation of Toji has more meaning than ever. Now, I love this voice actor, but I don't think I like him as Toji that much. I always felt like Toji would have a Jotaro voice, not a Dio voice. But then again, Toji is looking like a straight psycho half this arc. Obviously, Mappa is hiding their secret trap card for this season, which is, of course, going to be the anime beach episode. If you are a Gojo fangirl, you are going to lose your fucking mind. The Toji vs. Gojo fight is what a lot of people are waiting for here. It's not my favorite fight in the series, but I am excited to see it animated. I imagine we're going to get another trailer before the series comes out in July. This kind of vibrant coloring, though, is going to make the Dagon domain look insane. I mean, how many animes do you get two beach episodes in one season? And we're going to get to see old Shikigami Man get punked. I'm hyped to see Ghetto because his curse technique is so damn cool. Well, I guess it's really only as cool as the curse spirits he has stored. I really wish we got to see more interesting curse spirits with him, but I guess there's still time. Don't get me wrong, Giant Fish is awesome. Flying Magikarp is the number one form of transportation in Jujutsu Kaisen. Goto can float, but this thing can fly. And like Mappa usually does, they're expanding on the actual panel, so I expect to see that throughout the season. This scene in the manga is a lot more simplistic. When this season comes out, the discourse around Jujutsu Kaisen is going to skyrocket again. And from the descriptions of Tengen, you might suspect her of being best girl, but she's a fucking thumb, so each shit. Mappa pretty much always knocks it out of the park with animation. Toji and Gojo's fight is probably going to get like 30 million views on the Crunchyroll channel. And a bunch of Toji videos are going to pop up all over the internet suspiciously. So really, fangirls of this series are going to be eating good this summer. You get your succulent, dark-haired man, you get everyone's favorite K-pop star, and they'll get their beach episode about this future serial killer. We're going to get to see all of Toji's cool curse tools, and a whole new generation of Novara Copers are about to manifest. Like I said at the beginning of this video, I'm just waiting for Shibuya. Shibuya is the real main course of this season. Hidden Inventory is a great little mini arc, but that's just like a nice little tasty front runner. It's amazing, but it's amazing like Olive Garden breadsticks. But I'm just saying, when Megami starts making the ultimate hand shadow, you're about to be blessed with Jujutsu Kaisen ribeye steak. In a world of HBO miniseries and seasonal anime, we have been blessed by the Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2. It has descended from heaven to us to deliver the promised goods, and it only costs the will to live of every MAPPA animator. It's all fresh and new, everyone will care about it for at least three months. Lieutenant Gary is hyped, you should be too. This guy may be an asshole, but he does watch anime. That is my review of the JJK Zero sequel season 2 trailer. I'll be honest guys, I don't know how you talk about a 1 minute and 30 second trailer for 10 minutes. I don't think I've unlocked that curse technique yet. I mean, it's good. You know it's good. Everyone knows it's good. You want to hear me say good thing is good? Well, good thing is good. Sukuna's gonna put that blunder on max setting and change the internet forever. Yuji crying and puking in 4K, season 2 depression, be hyped. But really, I'm just waiting for you. But that's all I have to say for now, so if you want to support this channel, leave a like on the video, and if you like anime content in general, subscribe to this channel. And as always, thanks for watching.